Good morning everyone, this is Ranger Rob and Ranger Rob Country Living. Today's a very special day because today's Sherry's birthday. Woo Did they break a rabbit? I don't know. So, Sherry's, you want to know how old Sherry is? It's taken 30 years now for her to turn 30. So that's all I can tell you. Otherwise I get in trouble. So uh, we're going to do our chicken run and take water out to them. And we're taking a garbage bag with us to pick up after our uh, contractors because now that the snow's going away a little bit, it's starting to reveal itself. And uh, since it's Sherry's birthday, we're going to go to the casino, right? You're going to get rich and famous. I made her some omelets today, super yummy. So she, her mojo is at full peak. So she's gonna make us rich and famous at the casino. You betcha. Yep, so uh, anyway, let's get our chores done. Well, in yesterday's video, I told you my pump went out and it did. And then Sherry decided, oh, let's turn it back on and see what happens. And it came back on. And not only that, it, uh, that, that little hydrant thing over there, has not been working for months and now it's working so uh <laughs> woohoo one less thing to fix my gate is still broken and uh look at all the garbage we just just stepped out the front uh bell put a cup over there too <laughs> um but yeah we uh we haven't even got past the porch and sherry's picking up garbage uh, we even have plastic in our pond. So, I stand by what I say. I wasn't very happy the way they treated the property, but I am happy with the hardy board. So, yep. So, uh, how's it feel to be 30? Again? No, it's the first time. You've been 29 for 30 years. I know. I don't feel old. I can tell you that. <laughs> Do you know what that's for? Uh, no. We're finding all this mysterious stuff in our yard. It's going to take us a while to get our property back to normal. Whatever normal is. And we left our garage door open. Doing good. So I would have loved to have been here when all this snow came off the roof. It must have all slid down at once. That must have been quite a sight. You wouldn't want to be under there when that comes down. <laughs> All right, well, some of our snow is going away. Finally. Finally. And I see our girls are sitting there waiting for us, which means they want something. So we're going to get them fed, grab their eggs. We probably should get lots of eggs today because we didn't get very many yesterday. So uh, we'll see. Wait for me, Mom. Ah. You see our chairs again. What do we got? Ooh, oh. Lots of eggs. Eggs. Wow, look at that. Remember on this side we have ceramic eggs, which we need to pull out and wash eventually. But uh, it's also getting time for me to clean out the center section. But yeah, look at all those eggs. Yum, we just cooked cooked up six of them this morning and they're already replaced. Already at nine. Hi chickens. <laughs> Got two of you. Hi girls. Oh, yeah. Alright, check in the other side, see how many eggs we got. None there, none there. Look at the size of this one. Oh my gosh. Compared to this one. Whoever laid that egg should be waddling. That's a big egg. That's a big egg. <laughs> Hi, girl. <laughs> Hi, babies. Hi, chickens. Yeah, we're going to clean the house out today. Hi, baby. So, how many total eggs did you get, Mom? Lots of eggs to be cleaned, too. Um, I didn't know. 
A lot? It's <laughs> a lot of eggs. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. <laughs> Alright, do the math. 10. Baker, Baker's ten, dozen. 10, 10 chickens, 13 eggs. Must, must mean that they laid some later yesterday. So yeah, lots of eggs. Um, so I'm going to stop here and uh, come back here. I got to clean, uh, clean the house out, which is really simple. I take our gorilla cart, bring it right here, sweep it all out. And I'm going to do some of the side ones too, and it's easier without the camera.
Well, we got all the uh, sides in the middle cleaned out. Super easy. I was able to do it with my clean jacket. So it's not messy at all. Put it in the compost. And uh, this will, this one here will get the next one. We try to rotate them. By the time late spring comes, we're going to have some great compost. So there you go, guys. That's how I clean our chicken pens. And uh, <laughs> I just got to keep the dogs out of everything. All right. Well, chickens are all fed. Sherry did that. Chickens are all watered. And uh, we're good to go. So we're waiting for our water to thaw out and the hose there. So we're just letting it run. Which was a good opportunity to clean our ceramic eggs. So, uh, yeah. Except the water's going to be really cold. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so Sherry found a, a rag laying in our yard. So she was going to throw it away. This is all the garbage that we found in the yard. And there's still more. So, uh, may as well use it to clean up our ceramic eggs. But, yeah, they get kind of dirty over the time. But most of the time our eggs are pretty clean. Not perfect, but pretty clean. So I'm curious for you guys that are listening. For those of you that get eggs that are clean, that don't have any chicken stuff on them, do you wash them anyway? Or do you not wash them and keep the coating on them? Uh, we try. If we get an egg that's really clean... Uh, I don't wash them. Uh, my understanding is the coating on them helps preserve the eggs better. And uh, anyway, in the comments below, I'd love to hear what you do. Maybe you're totally against that. Maybe you're not. Um, for those that put eggs in lime, they say you don't want to wash your eggs because of the protective coating. So that's all I know, and I'm sticking to it. All right, so we got our eggs all cleaned up, our ceramic eggs. This is what they look like. Look really like normal eggs. The only way we can tell them apart is we put a little black dot on the ends of all of them. And uh, so I'm going to put them back. So that's what they look like back in there. We'll let the chickens uh, play with all their uh, new hay. And uh, make sure everything's closed up here. Cool. They're all cinched up and now we get the hose running, uh, we're going to clean out our five gallon waterer and get that working again since it's not freezing this week, but it probably will later. So it's a good day to do it. What are you doing, Bal? What are you doing? Are you chasing birds? Well, we have really happy chickens. They all got their water thing all filled up again got everything cleaned up sherry's heading back to the front of the shop to sh shut off the water so we can relieve the pressure because we'll probably have more freezing but it was good that we we're able to get the water back on so and then there's the two dorks what are you guys doing constant constant playing all right so sherry turned off the water uh, I just dropped the camera and my dogs were wrestling and knocked the camera out of my hand so I just got all the mud off of it. And we'll get the pressure out of this thing. And all will be good. Okay, we got our 13 eggs from our 10 chickens. And uh, we're we're done with the chicken run. Yay! Yay. So it's time to go play. You want to take the water? It's casino time. So uh, I'll try to let you know if a guy's got rich and famous. I'm think I think this is the day. I'm gonna make big bucks. Because it's my birthday. Because it's Sherry's birthday. And I made her a nice breakfast. Super high mojo. So uh I'll let you know how we did later. But uh I think that's all for this video, a lot of things on it. So uh, I want to thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over the whole wide world. Until next time, bye now. Our videos are made possible by Ranger Rob Poopy Bags. Available at Amazon right now. Thank you very much for watching our video. Please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over the whole wide world. Thanks.